So uh, my name is Julien Guenou and I am uh, the product manager for the iDrone 2.0. Okay, so uh, what we have here is uh, a product culture that you can actually control with your smartphone or tablet. So this works for Android, this works also for iOS of course, so iPad, iPhone, iPod Touch. And this comes with uh, an HD camera here in front of it, 720p, that you can actually use to watch live what the drone is actually seeing when it's flying. You can record it, you can share it, you can put it on the map called the Aerodrome Academy where all the pilots from all over the world share the video and uh, that's really, really so easy to fly. So um, the reason why it's so easy to fly is that you have a bunch of sensors that are right here. You can see two ultra sensors. sensors, you can see a vertical camera, but uh, virtually you have tens of uh, sensors in it that makes it really stable, meaning that um, when you just release all the controls, the drone will just hover by itself at a very specific position and won't move at all. Same thing when you lose the connection with the drone, it won't move. Uh, same thing when you're outside and it's a uh, windy condition, it won't move either. So it makes it the quite the easiest uh, flying object to actually pilot. Uh, we have a couple of other things also coming because people love actually to, to record video and to create their own videos and they want always more options to actually create the best video possible. So we got a mode that we call the director's mode where you will be able to do traveling moves, uh, panoramic shots, um, just like a director. You will be able also to um, uh, adjust the optical settings, uh, the white balance, the saturation and so on, something people are used to when they are using uh, cameras. Uh, and also post-process uh, all uh, the videos to stabilize them. So we will focus on video and we also have a GPS coming. So uh, GPS basically will track all your location and for example, just one example of the use of the GPS is to be able to watch exactly the flights you have been doing on a map. So here you see in 3D on the map um, the flight I've been doing yesterday here and with the video thumbnail attached. Uh, and the small drone here is doing its route and you watch the video at the same time happening uh, as, the, as the drone is moving forward. So with the GPS a lot of new also possible options opens. And, um, that's it. So the drone is available already uh, for retail at 299 and uh, those two new things uh, are the flight recorder, GPS and the mo director's mode uh, will release later this year. And then one more quick question, are you going to have any sorts of apps for it to make, you know, have some interactiveness with it, like with a game or some sort? Would you yes, exactly. That? Uh, that's a very good point, basically, uh, because uh, the reason why we're called the AR drone is for, stands for augmented reality, uh, meaning that uh, what we see with the camera can be used to actually create augmented reality content. So we have two games releasing uh, later this year, iRacing. 2 and I rescue 2 and basically you have one racing game using patterns on the ground to make a, a, a real track and measure the lap time and we have one shooting game with aliens that is I rescue 2 and those two use the camera and your phone to actually uh, play. And then one more quick question, would this just be on the iOS system or would this also be on the Android market? Uh, for the moment on the Android market we have the piloting application which is called I free flight and that is for free like all the applications. Uh, and the games are for the moment only on the, the iOS system. Alright, thank you. You're welcome. Good morning, I'm uh, Theodore Schoen, I'm the product manager at Parrot and I'm going to show you today the fabulous Zik headphones, the wireless uh, headphones uh, for smartphones and tablets. So, um, uh, we wanted to have uh, a headphones, wireless headphones that fit with the smartphone uh, world. So the first thing that we wanted to have on the smartphone is a very nice design and the designer didn't want to have uh, any buttons, so there is no buttons and we replaced the buttons by um, uh, um, a touch sensitive uh, panel. So here, to increase, decrease the sound, you're just doing that and that. If you want to skip to another track, you're doing that or that. And you want to play and pause, just tapping on it and that's it. And also we are thinking about uh, lazy people, uh, just kidding. Uh, if you want, if you remove the headphones from your, uh, from your head, then you have here a sensor who will detect your skin. So it will pause automatically uh, uh, the, the music. And when you put it back on your, on your head, the music returns. Uh, you also have the capability here to make calls. 
hands three cords. Uh, for that, you have a mini microphone, you have two microphones on the outside, and also here you have a, a jawbone sensor who is going to capture, to grab the vibration of your uh, jawbone. And then your interlocutor who will hear you uh, on the phone will hear only your, the, your voice uh, and not the noise around you. Uh, one amazing feature also that we have is uh, active noise cancelling and for, for that, uh, for having a very nice uh, active noise cancelling, we have put four microphones, two on the outside and two uh, on the inside. And then it's going to capture the sound, uh, the noise sorry, uh, on the outside and it's going to re-inject uh, in different ways in order to cancel uh, the noise. So at the end you will have 98% of the noise will be removed uh, from, uh, uh, from the headphones. Uh, we also have NFC technology here on the left. So if you have a smartphone with NFC technology, just by touching it, you get connected over Bluetooth. So it's a full of technology, but very simple to use. And the last point, which is uh, Cherish on the Cage, you have also an application called Part Audio Suite. We help you to customize your sound. And here you have a very nice features that we call Part Concert Hall that will help you to uh, have a better sound because our engineers find that uh, having the sounds coming out from right and left is not natural. So here, uh, just by pressing here, pressing here, you're going to shift the music from, from you, from your ears, to front of you. It's kind of magic. And you also have the possibility to enlarge the sound like this. And then you feel like that you are really uh, in a home theater or in a cinema. So if you are watching a movie on a, a tablet, for instance, you really feel like that you are in a cinema. So this is the fabulous product, Zik by Power Up, Zik Headphones. All right, that's some pretty great, interesting product that you guys have showcased this year. 2013, I was about to say 2012. Oh, you got some, some pretty nice drones that are coming out, which is pretty quick, and some pretty sweet headphones. Now, if you guys definitely want to see some more, maybe hands-on product reviews, hopefully I get some in the future now. But uh, of course, we go one more time for the audience. So I'm uh, Theodore Schoen, I'm the product manager for Parrot, and I presented the Zik headphones, the wireless Zik headphones. All right, thank you very much. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. We'll text something out. Bye. Bye.